I was born in Brooklyn, New York, and shortly thereafter moved to Texas. My parents came directly from Europe, from Nazi Germany and Nazi Austria. They were the lucky ones. My mom wanted to marry an American, but she met my dad with a very similar background, and they were married for 64 incredible years. I grew up in Austin, Texas. My parents had a profound impact on my brother and me. They stressed family and Jewish tradition, but they also stressed education. My dad being a professor at the University of Texas for over 50 years. I've been married to my husband, Henry, for 32 years. He's from Casablanca, and it has been quite a ride. We have one daughter, Nicole, who is an extraordinary individual. There is no question that I am more proud of her than anything else in my life. She went to Vanderbilt Law School, and now she is a third year associate at Baker Botts. And I guarantee you, I I've been practicing law now for 37 years, and I've loved every minute of it. I first joined a small litigation firm, and I was the first woman they hired, the first woman partner that they made, but that was 30 years ago. After 17 years with my law firm, I received my professional dream thanks to the late Governor Ann Richards. She appointed me judge to the 270th Civil District Court. After I left the bench, I made a decision at that time that I would spend the rest of my career in a different phase, doing mediation and arbitration. Okay. And 20 years later, I've conducted over 6,500 mediations all over the country and approximately 250 arbitrations. Outside work, I support the Houston Holocaust Museum. Their mission is to educate others about the Holocaust so that we never forget the six million Jews and other innocent victims who were murdered because of hate and prejudice. My advice to young women is that there are choices and consequences in life. Act with integrity and honesty. Do what's difficult, not just what's easy. Never lose your sense of humor. Get out there, volunteer, and never think that you can't do something. Dream. Dreams can come true. Mine did.